It's easy to apply effects and animations to widgets in your JustinMind prototypes. In this tutorial, we will show you how to create an animated image that will move across the screen from left to right, changing its default style. In a new web prototype, add an image widget to the canvas and select the image you want to use from your folders. Mark it as hidden in the Properties tab by checking the Hide Component box. In the Events tab, add an On Page Load and Pause event, which will pause the following event for the amount of time introduced. Leave the time as the default amount, 1000 milliseconds. Click OK. Back in the Canvas, Go to the Events tab and add an On Page Load and Show event. Select the image as the component to be displayed. Add a Fade effect with a duration of 500 milliseconds. Click OK. Back in the Canvas, add an action from the Events tab. To do this, click on the gear option above the event you've just created and select Add Action. Add an on-page load and move event and select the image as the component you want to move. In the bottom part of the dialog, set the left to offset at 600 pixels and leave the top position as it is. Add a linear easing effect with a duration of 1500 milliseconds. Click OK to go back to the canvas. In the Events tab, right-click on the action you've just created and add another action. This time it will be an on-page load and show action. Select the image as the component to be displayed and add a pulsate effect without any easing and a duration of 200 milliseconds. Click OK to go back to the canvas. Click Simulate to interact with your prototype. You will see that the image moves to the right of the screen, stops and flashes, signaling that it wants to turn back. In order to allow it to move back to the center of the screen, you need to change the style of the image. To do this, go to the Events tab and add an on-page load and set value event. Select the image as the component that has to display the value. Below, Select the Fixed option and upload another image. In our example, we've added the same image but inverted. Click OK twice to go back to the canvas. Like before, click on the gear icon next to the Show action and add another action. Select an On Page Load and Move event. Select the image as the element that has to move. This time set the left to offset, minus 600 pixels. This will make the image move back towards the center of the screen. Add a linear easing effect with a duration of 2000 milliseconds. Click OK. Finally, add another on page load and set value action. Selecting the image. Below, select the Fixed option and upload your initial image. Click OK twice. You can have the image move back and forth as many times as you like. To do so, simply copy and paste the whole event as many times as you need in the Events tab. And that's it! Click Simulate to see your prototype in action.